Hey guys, I finally got my ABS dialed down really good. I'm printing some electric skateboard hubs. Uh, these are actually, I've been using the PET G and they have not broken because I have a TPU sleeve that goes on top and really pr protects the PET G. But I did a hammer test earlier in my video, check it out. And it showed that the ABS is much, much stronger. This is the actual part I hammered um and it seems to live up really good it it wants to crack but it it doesn't it's so so strong so i decided to go with the abs now one of the things you'll have to worry about with abs is shrinkage when you print with abs um the same model will shrink a bit they say about one to two percent now with an enclosed voron um you're not getting any warping I noticed about 0.5% uh, shrinkage. So I basically make my model, um, I did. I made this 101% and it, it's actually slightly bigger than the PET G. Um, but it actually worked out perfect. My model was a little bit tight on tolerances. So I'm gonna go with 101. So before you, um, same model, you can just print it at 101 percent if you're using an enclosed Voron like I am or actually the exact would be like 100.5 when you scale it in a super slicer so that's what I would recommend if you're using Prusa slicer also I don't know how the shrinkage is on open end printers like Prusa it might be <coughs> more so before you test out a set of these I do recommend um, printing out and uh, comparing the dimensions like I said I would say roughly uh, with an enclosed printer, ABS shrinks about 0.5% for me. But I print this out 101 and it actually works out for what I'm doing here. And just tiny bit difference here, 101%. It's maybe like point, maybe diameter becomes like point, point like three millimeters bigger. Yeah, point literally like point two or something at 101. So yeah, do you think about a shrinkage um, test out a small model of your uh, subject. Simple way is to just increase it. But roughly, I would say 100.5% of your scale will work. Just raise it about 0.5% if using Boron 2.4. If using Perusa, you'll have to test out uh, how much shrinkage you're getting. Yeah, ABS shrinkage. Um, just simply make it a little larger and it should be good to go.